It's not working out. So you're, when you establish your values and morals, you're just able to help yourself succeed in better ways than if you did otherwise. So when you do that, you will not. What's up, YouTube? Oh, this is uh, Mike Lodel with uh, Lodel Fitness. Catch me on Instagram. Day one. Day one, first vlog ever. So uh, we're here trying to get it. Let's get it, guys. I need What's up guys, we're going to roll into a voiceover for our uh, workouts here. Uh, this is our leg workout, we started out with squats. As you see I'm warming up with the bar, I did the bar for two sets at about 10 to 12 reps, just kind of get things moving, get a little mobility going on. And then uh, we moved on to 135. I'm not going to show all of the sets because it gets repetitive, kind of boring for you guys. but. Uh, I did 135 for two sets to help warm up and I get everything going, making sure I'm squatting correctly. And then we moved on up here to 185. Again, everything has been going smooth, felt light, everything's going quick, so that's good. And with these lighter sets, I am trying to maintain that posture, keeping the uh, back straight, hitting depth, and really driving through my heels. Okay, just finishing up 225, moving on to 275. This is going to be the last acclimation set into going into my heavier singles for... Um, my uh, maximum effort leg day here. I'm trying to maintain my breathing and really uh, stabilizing my core to get a good powerful lift out of these two. Alright, so we're moving up into 315 and the next set will be 335, but I will let you guys listen into these clips raw. So you can kind of get the feel of how I was lifting that day. The 335 will definitely be a grinder though. So I, I dropped it back down to 275, kind of get a little extra volume with some, some heavier weight. I did three sets at 275 at five reps, and I'm not showing all of them, just showing you one because it gets repetitive as, as I said before. switch to some narrow stance squats where I didn't go all the way down and I didn't go all the way up keeping constant tension on my quads so I can get that volume in and then right after that it was kind of a pre-exhaust for these leg extensions where I just did three sets of 12 reps fairly lightweight 
just kept it moving, kept the blood going through. And then after these leg extensions, we moved on to leg curls. Again, fairly lightweight, just making sure we get the good contraction and uh, eccentric motions going on. Squeezing at the top and releasing slowly. Moving on after that, we moved on to deadlifts, where uh, we went from a three-inch deficit. I'm standing on a, a 45-pound bumper plate currently, and we worked up to heavy sets. I think I forgot to record the 365 set, but we worked up, and then we came back down in the end for a 5x5 five five at 225 that you will see a little later. And also what you guys did not see is I did uh, calf raises, seated calf raises. Just did three sets, easy sets at uh, 10 reps a piece. Nothing too big. And then here we just did some walking lunges to really uh, burn out the legs as a, a last workout or a last exercise. And we exaggerated the steps, making them longer and getting a good stretch as we go through the motions. Focus, focus, focus. Hey, there's some light here. Uh, all right guys, so just finished workout gonna hit that post-workout meal, you know It's important to get that get uh, your body Back in that recovery state recover do everything you need To build the most possible muscle because that's what we're about here fitness get better build that muscle So I mean who doesn't like that, but uh, we got right here. We got some some chicken already in the fridge here that I, I uh, pulled out it's a rotisserie chicken two rotisserie chickens that I put in a big ass bowl and I think we're gonna cook that with some Uncle Ben's rice so come over here in the pantry pick out some Uncle Ben's rice uh, go with this butter and garlic for now looking good looking good I'm gonna say this right off the bat, not counting macros right now, trying to gain a little more weight, a little more mass. Uh, just trying to get bigger for now, for this year. Probably competing maybe at the end of the next year or early 2017. So we're gonna go out and uh, cook this rice and uh, I'll see you in a little bit. We got that post-workout drink, Scoopa BPS Way HD. It looks like a vanilla caramel, if you can see that. Focus a little bit there. It don't want to focus, of course. But, uh, and then we got some uh, Isotory BioGrow, two scoops of that. I just got some leftover from my, my deployment and was trying it. Don't mind it, saw decent results off of it, so decided to stick with it. But, uh, Comes the important part right here. Got that that chicken on the microwave. That rotisserie chicken that I peeled yesterday. So seven ounces of chicken, two servings of Uncle Ben's uh, butter and garlic rice. So uh, I'm gonna dig in and uh, see you guys later. All right, uh, kind of introduce myself a little bit, but. Uh, it's a little more in depth. I mean, I know I'm trying not to ramble on because I know you guys don't like that kind of stuff, but military, Air Force, stationed in New Mexico at uh, Cannon Air Force Base, so Clovis, New Mexico. Not much around here, honestly, but uh, we got that gym. Nah, who doesn't like that? Finished legs today, it was good. I mean, great leg workout, kind of, I think it worked up to a uh, max effort at 335, so not too bad, not too bad. This channel here, hopefully motivate, maybe inspire, maybe show some people a few things, learn a few things. Always, always, always open to learn. And uh, comment below if you want to see anything special. I know this is a 
first vlog, first fitness video. Uh, tell me how to improve. How to improve is the biggest thing. I wanna, I wanna be here to entertain. 